Hello, everybody, and welcome to week four of the NDBL. Um, before we get into anything, this is a nine-week season, so next week we are officially halfway through the thing, and we are still sitting 0-3, which isn't great. Anyway, today I'm going to be breaking down our team for our week four battle against the Tennessee Teetars, coached by, I don't know, their name if they have one. Okay? Um... This is an important match because right now we are sitting at the number 9 position in the league. My friend Host, who I got to show in the league earlier, um, you guys, I might have mentioned that before, he is sitting at the number 8 spot. So he's clinching playoffs right now, but we're not. That's not okay. Uh, it's a 12-person league, top 8, get into playoffs. Um, and that's my aim, I want to get into playoffs. This I, was, I just want to get our first win, but getting into playoffs would be amazing. So, let's break down the Tennessee Teetars team before we go into ours. I'm sorry if I don't sound very enthusiastic, I am currently very, very ill. So their team is Mega Celix, Dragapult, Conkelda, Needle King, Porygon 2, Alolan Persian, the Fire-type Oricorio, Toxapex, Ferrothorn, Ember, and Subat. A pretty scary team. Um, they are currently sitting at 0-3 as well, which is interesting. It's not great for us, but it's also not terrible. Do you like how I'm making sense right now? Um, they don't have a fairy type on the team, meaning they've got a pretty solid dragon type weakness, was what I thought, but then they're carrying Jagapult and Ferrothorn, who are both dragon type resists, so I'm not 100% sure if bringing Jugalgy would be nice. And as you can see there, we didn't bring Jugalgy, so anyway, I'm not gonna waste your time and we're gonna hop right into the team builder. Most important thing this week. The debut of Darkseid are Umbreon, the only member of the team who hasn't arrived at a match yet. Um, good luck Darkseid, please get us off us one, that would be great. Um, I'm running an incredibly bulky set this week, as I saw bulk would help. Is it on fire? I know that's definitely not what you want to hear, um, it's, it's not with you, hopefully. If you're watching this in an open fire, please move away from the fire. I think my computer might be about to blow up. It's a very old computer, so maybe it might. Um, I'll have to look into that. Anyway, if I die halfway through this video, it's your guys' fault. Um, for Dark Side, we are running Leftovers, Incredibly Bulky, Toxic Moonlight, Foul Play, and Heal Bell. All of our sets have gone into our defenses and HP because I want this thing to be able to tank a lot of hits. Um, Foul Play uses the opponent's attack stat, but mostly this thing has a Toxic to deal chip damage, especially on that Porygon. Moonlight to heal and heal bell to get rid of any status conditions like burn, paralysis, especially toxic. Our second pick to come this week is Ganon. We need a way to get rid of hazards. This thing is they are carrying Ferrothorn and Toxipex on their team, two of the best hazard setters in existence. Um, so this thing has gone into quite a bit into speed. We are carrying Rapid Spin, obviously, or a Sphere to deal with Ferrothorn. Scald to hopefully get a burn and stuff, and flip down for a little bit of priority, and those heavy duty boots, so we can switch in a lot. High Ducky is coming back, because I really enjoyed High Ducky every time we've brought them. Um, with Leftovers and the Levitate ability, this thing is carrying Moonlight to heal, Thunder Wave to just really annoy the team, Moonbass, and Calm Mind. Because if we can set up enough Calm Minds, we can just run through their team. Um, again, very, very bulky thing. This thing isn't meant to do too much damage, unless I imagine this is set up. Artemis, Arc of Fable, the only other mon who's come every single week, has come yet again. Um, Life Orb this time, so we're trying to hit hard with this thing. Softball, Moonblast, Fireblast, and Psychic. Um, all the blasts today. Hopefully Artemis will be able to get a lot of kills. Um, right now, Artemis, despite coming the most and being our number one pick, isn't our kill leader, it's Bisharp, who's sitting at two kills. Artemis is only sitting at one. Same as Ganon. Um, no one else on his team has gotten a kill yet. But, Artemis, please, just destroy them. I'm begging you. Anyway, um, decks. Again, I'm very tired, so you can't hold anything of what I'm saying against me. The cringeness factor. Um, Dex is carrying the choice specs, which, um, this thing needs to do a lot of damage. We've got Pain Split, um, which is to switch in and get a lot of HP away from something and then switch out. Um, Thunder Wave, just to, like, we're naturally a fast Pokemon, so that's going to do, and it helps us speed, like, control the team. 
and Thunder and Shadow Ball are just those hard-hitting stab moves. And finally, we haven't had this thing since week one, Helen the Mega Camera Raptors here with its sheer force ability, Earth Power, Overheat, Iron Head, and Stealth Rock, all those stats, very, very nice. Helen is hopefully going to do a lot of damage. I'm going to let you guys get into the match. Um, hope you have a dogtastic day, and let's fly Flygons. Three, two, one. Okay, um, we're in the battle. I haven't recorded the team builder yet, and I am very sick, as I probably mentioned from said team builder. We're about to hop into our week four match. Um, we are up against somebody who has yet to get a win, but you know what? So are we, so it's going to be a fair fight. Um, showdown damage calculator. Just looking this up on something. Let's use a lead. I think. Camera wrapped. I'm feeling Helen. The vibes. Oh, wait, they're probably going to with Steelix. And my thing against Steelix is to go into Ganon. Okay, so if they've gone with Steelix, I'm going to assume there's a Stealth Rock variant. I'm um, missing a Mega Steelix, so we'll assume that. Up against our boy Ganon. I put in the name Ganon, not Blastoise. Um, also, I have a white noise machine in the back of not white noise machine, an air humidifier, if that makes any sense. Um, basically it's there, it helps me breathe because I've had a stuffed nose, but I can two-hit kill this thing, and it can't do anything to me. So I think, wait, what, what happens if I'm running Aura Sphere? I just need to make a few adjustments, Aura Sphere, there we go. Scald is still my best bet. They're gonna go into Macintosh. If I can burn this thing, that's gonna be huge. I do not get the burn. Um, okay, so this thing's probably gonna go to Toxic, I would say. I don't really have a huge, um, great counter to this, apart from my Umbreon, so I think I wanna flip turn out into that. Um, this thing might go for Thunderbolt. No, Wi-Fi. Head in the game. I have toxic that thing with Synchronize, which is very nice. Um, okay. I think I can safely foul play here into something. Get the foul play off. They're going to set up a trick room. Okay, so we're both being hurt. Um, I would like to heal Bell. Okay, I feel like I won that exchange Porygon. So... I'm just gonna foul play into something, you know. They might try to hurt me again, that's fine. I know this thing is carrying Eviolite. Okay, we're gonna get to foul play the Steelix. So this thing is very- this thing is min speed. And it's got two turns of this left. I need to get Helen in. This thing is absolutely min speed if this is a trick room team. Um, so it's probably gonna go for Earthquake. So Mega Camera Upt. Kind of a tanky set. This, if this thing uses Earthquake, there's a 100% actually wait, what's my defense stats on Camera Upt? Um, I have got a defense of 176. And should be higher than that, so. Don't know how I managed to do that. But this thing's probably gonna go for Earthquake, isn't it? I could Thunder- no, I can't Thunder Wave it. I could Fire Blast it though. Wait, no, no I can't. Um, I think I can send in High Duck here. This thing can do nothing. Nothing. Look at that, nothing damage. You're nothing, Steelix! <laughs> nothing! Um, I would like to kind of call mind here. Actually, um, yeah, I'm gonna call mind. Because I don't think this thing can do too much to me. If I win my first ever draft league match, um, while well, absolutely lost in the source sick, like, this has been top two worst colds I have ever had. Um, call mind again. What are you gonna do now? Punk? 
Ooh. Ooh, I got that levitate. Ooh, I'm gonna set up a third card mind. Ooh, I'm setting up on you. I'm gonna go for a fourth one. I'm I'm getting I'm getting hungry. I'm gonna moon blast. Okay, so I should tell you the story of my worst cold, because I kinda set it up for you. This one's not been too bad. Oh Hi Ducky just sits in here right now. This one hasn't been too bad. Um like compared to the worst one I've ever had, which was a nightmare. I was absolutely lost in the source that time. Um, so this one, I started with a sore throat. I don't think it's the thing that's going around the world right now, but you know what, we're gonna see. Um, I started with a sore throat, and um, it kind of just started getting worse from there. Like, it started halfway through the day, it was suddenly getting worse, like, very, very much worse. Um, then I, I hardly slept that night, and it got to the point that like, I slept a solid two hours the first night I had a cold. Then, um, I got a stuffed nose and a headache and nausea and I was vomiting. I know, this is a pleasant story to hear. Okay, now this thing comes out. I was expecting it earlier. But I'm glad I really got to hurt that Steelix. I should have killed it when I had the chance. Um, I'm gonna thunder wave it. They're gonna toxic me, you know, that's fine. Um, who was our switch into this? I've gotten to really hurt their team now, which I like. So now I can hit this thing with a, um, thunder. They could go into Steelix, but if they go into Steelix, I can just say that with a shadow ball. I'm gonna miss the thunder, which sucks! They're gonna toxic decks, I'm totally fine with that. Um, we are carrying choice specs. And they're gonna get to go into Steelix. Oh, that thunder miss! And now I gotta swap out again. I'm gonna go into Hideki. They're gonna autotomize. They are slightly faster. I'm gonna moonblast something on their team. They're gonna live that. Body press is gonna come out. You know, Hideki kind of ruins them, so I'm gonna moonblast once again. <laughs> Hideki's gonna pick up a second kill. No, this, so this thing is carrying Black Sludge, which sucks, so I gotta do a lot of damage to this. Um, okay. Toxic and Hex. Um. I think I wanna go Dark Side, because this thing's gonna. Yeah, that is nothing. Get to heal up with some leftovers. I'm gonna use heal bell. Okay, I get a free heal bell off. Which is very nice. Ooh, so they're guts. That's fine. Um probably gonna go for a fighting type move here, aren't they? What does Conkel to get? Um also, shout out to Darkseid, it's you, that guy's first match and he's already heal belled twice. Not the, quite the MVP, because Hyduck is doing very well, absolutely warring that Steelix. But I'm really glad the Dragapult's out of the way, because that thing was a huge threat. Um, team Builder? New team. Add Pokemon. Um, what are we looking at, Conk? Elder, do you get a Steel-type move? Doesn't look like you have a good move pool here, honestly. Get Poison Jab, and Taunt, so my best bet is to go into High Ducky here. Okay, that lowers my speed, that's fine. Um, okay. I don't want this thing setting up on me, so I'm just gonna... They're gonna Facade, that's a lot of damage. Okay, so they're gonna go down a bit. Um, how much did they do to me? 44%, I don't live that, so I need to go into something else. Um, 281 speed. We're faster than this thing. So I could go into uh, decks and Shadow Ball it. Does that kill it? Um, Conk, Elder, OU Guts. 
against my boy Rotom, who I found out today has defog. If I hit this thing with a thunder, is that KO? Because Thunderbolt is a lot. Um, thunder 100% knocks this thing out. That's only if they go for facade here. <laughs> we get it. Um, okay. Um, I kind of want, I really don't want to go for that. Shadow Ball does 63%. I'm gonna go for Shadow Ball. Okay, it's Felix, and Rotom's gonna pick up their first ever kill. No, that's fine. That kick specs. It scares me. So much. Okay, in comes this thing. So this thing can do nothing to Hideki, and I want to kill Hideki up. They're gonna toxic me. Fine. I'm going to Moonlight. Um, and then I'm going to... So this thing is carrying Toxic Trick Program, Recover, and Thunderbolt. This will take a to interrupt. And they're gonna go Toxic Packs. Okay, who's faster here? We are 196 speed and this thing is 185 speed. Do we kill it? Um... I just realized I totally in um, interrupted myself. I was talking about the worst time I ever got sick. It was on camp. Um, it was my year 10 camp. We did camp every year at my school. And, um, yeah, so Earth Power. What is my special attack? 309? Yeah, Earth Power kills this thing. Earth Power doesn't. Uh, guys, Earth Power does not kill it, but they made a mistake. They went for Toxic instead. They thought I'd switch out. I just Earth Power. I didn't Mega Evolve. Whoops. Okay, so I was, um, it was, we had two days after camp, so two nights, is what I mean. And I was, well, the first night, I, I felt fine when I was going to bed. No, it doesn't. Okay, Mega Camera, just kill this thing. With a, uh, Earth Power again. Okay, that thing's dead. That thing's dead. I'm not taking this match seriously because I feel really confident right now, and I know for a fact that I'm going to mess this up, and I'm not going to get the win this time. I've never gotten a Jaffa League win before, and it's not going to happen this time, um, so I'm trying not to take it seriously. So, uh, who do we swap into here? Artemis. Yeah, because they're going to try to go for Facade here. No, not Facade, they could- they're probably going to go for a Dark type move. I want to kill Dex. I got the prediction correct. Okay, I get to now freely Shadow Ball something. Yes, I want to Shadow Ball here. Dex is gonna get the knockout, that's very nice. Um, so I was- I went to bed, I wasn't feeling great. I think I can just Shadow Ball this thing again. Nope, not risking it. Guys, we're gonna be stupid, we're gonna ruin this into Clefable. Um, so I was feeling so, 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 so ill. Um, no I wasn't. Ooh, that head smash miss. How much would that have done? I'm not even looking up. Uh... I think I psychic here. Ooh, they're gonna head smash, that's a lot of damage! Oh, so they would've knocked us out! <laughs> okay, now this Toxpex is about to ruin our day. This Toxpex is about to ruin our day. Oh my gosh. Guys, guys, we're about to do it. Guys, we're about to win our first ever job league match. We're actually about to do it. Oh my! Come on, Artemis, finish this. We did it. Wait, I actually need a minute. I need a minute here. Oh my god. We just won our first match and we 6 0 them. <sighs> okay, never mind, today wasn't that bad a day. I need to get that replay. Oh my. Guys, we won our first traveling match and I feel so ill. So, 
I can now focus and talk to you guys. First of all, incredible work, everyone, Artemis especially, who I think got three KOs at the end. Very nice. Um, okay, here's what happened when I was very, very ill. So, um, we had two nights left. I went to bed feeling fine, but then I had this fever dream in the middle of the night that um, the whole campsite kept moving different places and I was getting stressed about it, but I kind of knew it was a dream, but I didn't know it was a dream. Um, then when I woke up, I had a stuffed nose, and this was like, I've had stuffed noses before, but this was bad, like, I could not breathe through either nostril. Um, and then it went on to that night, and I did not sleep at all the entire night. It was awful, because I was in a tent, I couldn't get Lemsit or anything to help me, so I, what I did was, I was sniffing so much, I couldn't sleep in a tent with my friends, because I felt so bad, because they were all being kept up by me. So I went to this one tent we designated for the bags, and I just slept in that, with this huge spider, who I didn't find out was there till morning, which still freaks me out at night. I slept so badly, I ended up getting up at like 4am when the sun came out to just read my book standing up, because that made me be able to breathe a little bit. One of the worst experiences of my life, never want to do that again. We won our first Jarfig match! Oh my god, Dark Side comes one week. We win like 10 weeks, we lose 10 weeks in a row. Dark Side comes once and scores the first ever victory your Florida Flygons have ever seen! Mm. Okay, best day of my life. This is amazing. Thank you all so much. Artemis, MVP. Thank you all so much for everything. I'll see you all in the next one, and let's fight Flygons. Are they out? Goodbye.